Lord. Praise the Lord. Welcome to church, everyone. Now we're going straight to our Bible reading. Please, if you see how much strength, can we just stand for the reading of the Word of God? Our Bible reading will be from 2 Kings 5, 1, 17. 2 Kings 5, 1, 17. of the host of the king of Syria was a great man with his master and honorable because by, the, by him the Lord had given deliverance unto Syria. He was also a mighty man in valor, but he was a leper. And the Syrians had gone out by companies and had obtained away captives out of the land of the, of the Israel, a little maid, and she waited on Naaman's wife. And she said unto her mistress, Would God my Lord wherewith the prophet that eats in Samaria, for he would re re for he would recover him of his leprosy. And one went in and told his Lord, saying, Thus and thus, said the maid that is of the land of Israel. And the king of Syria said, Go to, go, and I will send a letter unto the king of Israel. And he departed and took with him ten talents of silver, and six thousand pieces of gold, and ten changes of raiment, and they brought the letter to the king of Israel, saying, Now, when this letter is come unto thee, behold, I am there with sent name and my servant to thee, that thou mayest recover him of his leprosy. And it came to pass, when the king of Syria had read this letter, that he went to scrolls and said, Am I God to kill and to make a life? That this man went sent unto me to recover a man of his leprosy. Wherefore, consider, I pray thee, and see how he seeketh a quarrel against me. And it was so that Elisha, the man of God, had heard that the king of Israel had rent his, his clothes, and, and he had said to the king, saying, Wherefore hast thou rent thy clothes? Let him come now to me, and he shall know that there is a prophet in Israel. Amen. So Naaman came with his horses and with his chariots and stood at the door of the house of Elisha. And Elisha said, sent his messenger unto him, saying, Go and wash in Jordan seven times, and thy flesh shall come again to thee. Thou shalt be clean. But Naaman was washed, and went away, and said, Behold, I thought you would surely come out to me, and stand, and come on the name of the God is God, and strike his hand over the place, and recover the leper. I thought Abana and Fafa, rivers of Damascus, better than all the waters of Israel. Did I not wash in them and be clean? So he, he turned and went away in rage. And his servant came near and spoke unto him and said, My father, if the prophet had bid thee to do some great things, would I have done it? How much rather then, when he said to thee, wash and be clean? Then went he down and dipped seven times in Jordan, according to the saying of the man of God. And his flesh came again, like unto the flesh of and he was clean. And he returned to the man of God, he and all the and, and came and stood before him and said, Behold, now I know that there is no God in all the earth but in Israel. Now therefore, I pray thee, take a blessing of thy servant. But he said, As the Lord liveth, before whom I stand, I will receive none. And he urged him to take it away, but he refused. Verse 17, the last verse. And Amen said, Shall then not then, I pray thee, be given to the perfect two more body of hands, for thy servants will henceforth offer neither burnt offerings nor sacrifice unto other gods, but unto the Lord. And the Lord bless the reading and the hearing of his word in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.